Well, good morning guys. I'm off this week. I have a full week of relaxation um, and tinkering in my shed. So it's probably going to be a harder week's work than I normally do because I need to completely change this shed around. It is doing my head in. I need to get it all properly laid out. It's just there's so much stuff going to be thrown on the tip, uh, but not metal. It's no, no scrap metal is going on the tip. Um, <laughs> but I'll flip you around and just show you exactly what I mean. So this is basically what I'm presented with as I walk in the shed. Yeah. I might have said in a previous video, all them are from my early days as a reseller. They're all going, donating the lot. I've had enough. I made the bar, said that in an earlier video. But it's this area I want to concentrate on. So I've shifted my lad's canoe and all that fishing reels and stuff that were on top. I'm basically today going to try and clear this area here so these won't be here. Nothing will be here. All the junk on the floor will be gone. I can get all my shelf space sorted out and properly laid out and have a nice light over this bench. I haven't got one over here. I've got natural light. Well, that's no good at night time when you're in here scrapping. So, this bench may stay, not too sure. But what I want to move over is this, <laughs> my old bar. Um, it used to be in the house. It, not, not as a bar. It was a, an old cupboard that the missus no longer wanted, so we got rid of it. Anyway, I brought it in here last Christmas thinking, oh, I'll have myself a bar, but uh, when you're the only guy in the bar, it's a bit lonesome. <laughs> um, so that base unit is going over here. Okay. Um, well, that's what I've got in my head anyway. Uh, but uh, we'll see how it pans out. I used to have some... these. These on the other side of this, there was some uh, like lead, leaded glass fronted drawers, whatever you call them. Anyway, I was looking at the hinges on them because I'm going to throw them away. Looking on the hinges on them, it's brass. <laughs> so the only place they're going is in the brass bin. Now, this is lead. I don't know whether to take all that lead out or just, I don't know, just drop the two glass door fronts off at the tip people pick things like that up don't they and stick them around gardens make arty farty kind of stuff anyway so i'll keep you updated during the day as to how i'm going on um yeah all right guys catch you in a bit oh dear me i don't know if i'm actually making any progress i seem to be making more mess Finding things and spending ages looking at them. I think, you know, not seen them for years. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, well. Not much of an update, but um, it's kind of an update. God. Hey, look at this. My lads are grown up now. I made this years ago out of, uh, what is it? Plywood or something. Yeah. Stuck it in the garden. Oh, forgot I made that. And that big sign at the back, it all lit up. Made it, it spelled Merry Christmas. Had that over the top of the shed. Yeah, need the shit you find after all these years. Right, I'm due, my lad's due back in a bit with me you And the beer. Hmm, beer o'clock. Finally he's arrived. into these bad boys eh? <laughs> come on have a look oh there we go there we go some liquid refreshment oh yeah right let's get them out of there start getting this back of this ute loaded up to the tip all right guys so the the bar is no more. Oh dear. Um, <laughs> but I've not had my last drink in the shed. So, I've basically had to skull drag it round. Because uh, everyone's gone out. Apart from the missus. I don't think she's up for helping me in here. Anyway, it's another story. So, this is the way I want 
the this thing to be over there i.e this way facing this way so i've just got to somehow try and push me pull me over there right let's see how we go oh god almighty well <clears throat> after a lot of pushing and pulling it's finally there now i'm choosing to leave these end pieces on hopefully it'll stop things rolling off and i can use the uh the insides not just to store me beer but uh, keep bits and pieces now the back part here um as you can see down there stuff's going to roll off in it so i need to sort that out i need to put a plank of wood at the back of there just to stop things disappearing forever um but yeah up to now pretty chuffed now the tv tv that's important isn't it i'm going to put that I'll put it there, can I? So I can, you know, just uh, watch me Planet of the Apes and everything. Right. Created a big space there, which will get cleaned out. So hopefully my lad will be able to get his car in there. Now, filing cabinets, where am I going to put them? Oh, God. Uh, I wonder if I got rid of this. Because I could put that vice over there. Hmm. All right, I'll have a think. Oh. Here's another beer. Okay, guys, does it actually look as though I'm getting any nearer? Ugh, I'm actually shattered. Where's that coming through from? Oh, sunlight. Right, so, created this shelf at the back, and that should stop stuff, you know, falling down the back. I've yet to bolt that to the, see if it focused that piece of board to the back wall of the shed. Is that falling on me because I intend to put you know talk trays things like that um i think it's getting better i'm actually gonna remove this bench thing i was thinking of putting my vice there but i had an idea what i thought was when all this nonsense is gone i can fit if you like a bench here on wheels which you can you know lock the wheels in so it won't roll away just for stripping stuff down on so i think i'll get rid of that put these filing cabinets over there somehow well we'll see Whew. well guys it's been a long day i managed to shift the bar area cleared up some space oh Yep, put my TV there, I decided it would go there. Now those of you wondering why this filing cabinet's the other way around, it's because there's a water pump in the back and I just couldn't get it all the way in the other way around. So the light works. I need to still sort out around here, obviously I need to sort out this bench. It's looking very Ian Matthews. Um, all these shelf spaces will be fully utilized in the coming weeks as soon as this is gone <laughs> my mountain of ink uh, what i am going to do is um i was going to mount the pillar drill and this wire stripper to this little desk um but i want to get something where i can put wheels on it and slide it around because obviously I, my lads have to try to get his car in here so i will put that over there when uh, when I've got wheels on it or something different and yeah should be good to go I'm gonna call it a day now guys I'm absolutely cream crackered so I'm gonna tuck into a few of these beers and watch a bit of TV catch you later guys